Hi guys, welcome to Dr. AI YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to talk about pectoralis major. Pectoralis major muscle is the most important muscle in pectoral region. This is a very strong muscle and this is fan shaped. So first, we will talk about the proximal attachments of this pectoralis major muscle. There are two heads of origin of this muscle as clavicular head and sternocostal head. So the clavicular head arises from the anterior surface that means the front surface of medial half of clavicle. So this is the clavicular head and the second origin is sternocostal head and it arises from the anterior surface, that means the front surface of sternum, superior six costal cartilage and aponeurosis of external oblique muscle. Here you can see the anterior surface of sternum, that means the front surface and the superior six costal cartilage and aponeurosis of oblique muscle. So, this tree is known as the sternocostal head. Then the pectoralis major muscle get insert into the intertubercular sulcus of humerus. So, this is the intertubercular sulcus. Here you can see the lateral lip of this intertubercular sulcus. So this is the distal attachment of this pectoralis major muscle. So this muscle arises from the clavicular head and sternocostal head. Then they get insert into this lateral lip of intertubercular sulcus. So now let's talk about the innovation of this muscle. So this muscle is innervated by lateral pectoral nerve and medial pectoral nerve. So this lateral pectoral nerve arises from lateral cord of brachial plexus and it's typically from the root of C5, C6 and C7. And this medial pectoral nerve is arises from the medial cord of brachial plexus and it is typically from the root of C8 and T1. This is a very important point as this pectoralis major muscle is innervated by all the five nerve roots. So that is very important. And now let's talk about the action of this pectoralis major. So there are three main actions can be done by using this pectoralis major muscle. They are adduct and medial rotator of humerus and flexion of shoulder joint by the clavicular head and depression by the costal cartilage. So that's all about pectoralis major muscle. I think you have got a clear idea about this muscle. So if you like this video, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you guys.